Today, we've got another CGC return and we're giving two slabs away to two lucky winners. All you gotta do, subscribe to the channel and leave a comment down in the comment section. Let's get into it. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. We're just gonna get right into it. We got some good stuff today. It looks great on the back. Ditto, Hollow Rare from Scarlet and Violet 151. I think this is gonna be more like an eight and a half or a nine. Oh, nice, 9.5 mint plus. Starting off hot, let's keep it to the nine to 10 range. Scream Tail promo Paradox Rift ETB. I think this is nine worthy. Oh, nice, we got the gem in 10. We'll definitely take that. Let's see how well we do with the 10s. Got a modern Japanese card. I mean, the Mew Hollow from V Star Universe. Uh, I mean, 10, easy. Yep, gem in 10. I'm telling you, pack fresh Japanese cards. I have never gotten less than a 10. I love that Mew though. Starting off hot with two 10s. Nice, let's keep it going. With the Iron Bundle promo from the Paradox Rift ETB, I'm gonna go with a 9.5. Gem Mint 10, right on three off the bat already and another modern japanese card the iron valiant ex from future flash 10 boom i don't even have to think about the japanese cards anymore i always get a 10 on them oh all right we got the pristine 10 gold label and it's a modern japanese card let's just flip it over and see nice yes this is one i really wanted to pristine on the Pidgeot EX from Shiny Treasures. We are really starting off hot. We already got four Gem Mint 10s and one Pristine 10 out of six cards. You can't beat that. This is insane. Let's just keep it going with another modern Japanese card. King Gambit from Shiny Treasures EX. Nice shiny. It's a 10. Whoa. Oh, what? I got a little overzealous there, I guess. This is the first. A pack fresh Japanese card got an eight and a half. I think eight and a half is a little critical, but uh, hey, we'll take it regardless. Another modern Japanese card. Let's slow our roll for a minute. Fido from Shiny Treasures EX. This one has got to be a 10. There we go. Okay, we got another Gem Mint 10. We're six out of eight for Gem Mint 10s. Doing fantastic. The Entei. Oh, I love this card. It's at least a nine and a half, though. Come on. All right. Thank you. Gem Mint 10, what it should be. There was nothing wrong here. Very nice. My favorite card pulled out of Shiny Treasures EX so far. I love this Entei. Seven out of nine, Gem in 10. And this is our Tops card. A Wiggly Tough from the Tops TV animation series. I love the Tops cards. It's probably an eight or eight and a half, I'd say. Whoa, really? Nice. I grew up with these Tops cards. I used to be able to get booster boxes of these Tops cards for 20 bucks at Target. This brings me back, and we got a 10 on it. 8 out of 10, Gem Mint 10. Come on, let's keep it going. The Mewtwo EX from Paradox Rift. I'm going to guess a 9, 9.5. Nine there it is again. 11 cards and 8 Gem Mint 10s with one pristine 10. This channel officially kills it with grading. I I'm just going to call it. We score the good grades here. Dragonair, non hollow rare from base set. It is jacked up and there's this stain up here. So I'm going to guess a four, four and a half. Okay, five. I'm, I'll definitely take it. Better than I thought. It's a base set card. Yes, I'm going to grade it. I'm not throwing away a vintage base set rare. Another modern Japanese card. The Heatran Diamond and Pearl promo, the, the Maijai Chocolate. I'm not familiar with this or any of the other ones. It was sealed, so this has got to be a 10. Hold on. Okay, this one is very wrong. There's no way this is a six. Everything is clean. There's no creases or anything in it. There's no way that this is a six. Yeah, it was graded poorly. But hey, what can you do? Just have fun with it, you know? Don't get all cranky about it. 
Gyarados Hollow, Scarlet and Violet 151. I mean, 10. Nothing wrong with it. Boom. Gem in 10. Nice. Yet another one. Iron Valiant EX. This is the Black Star promo from the Iron Valiant EX box. 10. Oh my gosh. I did not expect so many 10s. This is wild. The Roaring Moon EX promo from the Roaring Moon EX box. Yet again, I gotta go with a 10. Okay, I am psyched out of my mind. Wow, okay, this may be our best submission yet. Only four cards are less than a Gem Mint 10. Let's keep it going. Professor Turo Scenario, Special Illustration Rare. It's gotta be a 10, I mean, Holy freaking crap. 13 out of 17 cards are 10s. Let's keep it going. This is wild, man. Okay. Snorunt, Illustration Rare, Paradox Rift. I'm going to go with a, a nine or nine and a half. Nine and a half. Mint Plus. Wow, we're doing so good. I'm having a blast with this channel, and I thank you all so much for joining me on this journey. This is so much fun. Professor Seda's Vitality Full Art from Paradox Rift. Again, it's gotta be a 10. Holy. <laughs> With how excited I am, I am literally getting exhausted. I'm freaking out over here. Let's just keep it going. Okay, the Cordon EX Hyper Rare. I'm gonna go with a 9.5. Son of a gun. Son of a gun. I'm going to be calm. Right now, we only have five cards that are not gem in 10. This is not a 10. Look at all the edge wear. <laughs> I can't believe I'm getting excited that it might not be a 10. I'm giving my heart a break for a minute. Get a break from the 10s. We got the Swampert non hollow rare from EX Ruby and Sapphire. Of of course, I'm gonna send this in. It's vintage. I don't care how jacked up it is. I ain't throwing it away. I think at least a six, six and a half. Okay, 5.5. .5. We'll take it. Again, EX Ruby and Sapphire, 2003. I don't care. We're grading it. Darumaka Hollow Promo from the Emerging Powers Collection Box. I think it's probably an eight and a half or nine, I think. Nine. Okay. Right on the money there. We'll take that for sure. Next up, another modern Japanese card. The Chansey Pokeball Reverse Hollow. Not the Master Ball, but the regular Pokeball Reverse from Pokemon Card 151. It's probably going to be eight, an eight, eight and a half is what I'm going to guess. Oh, another 10 for the pile. Good grief. Oh, people, we got two pristine 10s. Modern Japanese. Let's just see what it is. Nice, it's the Ghastly Pokeball Reverse Hollow from Pokemon Card 151 in a pristine 10. Wow, I think this is the best great reveal we've had yet. Let's keep it going with the Roaring Moon EX from Paradox Rift. Nine, nine and a half, I think. Nine, okay. We will take it. Nine. Professor Turo Scenario Full Art Paradox Rift. It's got to be 9.5 or 10. 9.5. All right. That works. Nice card. Slither Wing Illustration Rare Paradox Rift. 10. Gem Man 10. There's another one. Good grief, people. This is crazy. We're nearing the end, and our Gem Man 10 pile is most of the cards. Here we go. Sco Villain Illustration Rare from Scarlet and Violet Base. I think it's more a 9. Mint nine. Nice. Right on the money. All right. We're nearing the end. Iron Bundle Hollow Promo. The pre release. Oh, it's an error. It says it's the staff one, but it is not the staff one. I don't know how it ended up with staff on the label, but I think it's at least nine or nine five. Nine five. Okay. Nine five. Iron Bundle pre release promo not staff garganeckle illustration rare paradox rift this one's probably more of a nine because it's off center yep at nine there we go radiant alakazam silver tempest this is probably a 9.5 oh 
Sweet Gemmin 10. Nice. I love this Radiant Alex Sam. All right, two more cards left. We sent in two of the Radiant Alakazams. Nine, five. Okay, nine. A nine and a 10. And our final card of the reveal. We did so good on this one, folks. Snoron. Yes, we sent in two of these as well. This last one is way off center, so it's probably a nine. Eight, five. Okay. Hey, that's fine. You can't complain about that. All right, people. This is our 10 pile. And this is our non-10 pile. Look at this. We still beat 50%. We kill it in the great reveals on this channel. And to boot, two of them are pristine tens. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you on the next one.